Did you know that your iPhone display has more pixels than your eye? Every recent iPhone, from the iPhone 11 Pro to the iPhone 15, has had the same type of display, the Super Retina XDR. And I know what you're thinking. We're in the future, can't they make a Super Super Retina XDR? And the answer to that question is, not really. Let's explain. Your phone screen is made up of millions of colored dots called pixels, and these come in two main types. Apple's Super Retina XDR display is an OLED display, which stands for Organic Light Emitting Diode. The pixels in these displays are like teeny tiny colored light bulbs. This is different to a cheaper LCD or liquid crystal display, which shines a white backlight through millions of teeny tiny color filters. Nearly every phone company has stopped using LCDs on their flagship phones. Samsung's AMOLED display and Google's Actua display are types of OLED screen. Cameras have pixels too. Behind the lens of your camera are millions of tiny light detectors, which measure how much red, green, or blue light is in each pixel of the image. And your eye works in the exact same way. Your retina also has millions of tiny sensors, in order to be able to tell two pixels apart, the light from each of them has to hit different sensor cells on your retina. If they're so close that their light hits the same cell, then the image blurs together into one. Now that's the sciencey part out of the way, let's get to the real question. How many pixels can the human eye see? Well, from a distance of 12 inches, the answer is about 300 pixels per inch of screen. Super Retina XDR displays have a pixel density of a whopping 460 pixels per inch, which means you'd need to be holding your phone just eight inches from your face before you can tell the individual pixels apart. And if you're holding your phone any closer than that, then you best stop it. You'll get square eyes if you hold it any closer. <laughs> but what does XDR mean? XDR stands for Extreme Dynamic Range, which basically means there can be a huge amount of difference between the dark and bright areas of an image. Apple boasts that their latest XDR displays that are on the iPhone 15 Pro can reach an eyeball sizzling 2000 nits of brightness, which is literally as bright as a sunrise. On a cheaper LCD display, the bright white backlight can bleed through the screen, making areas of your image that are supposed to be pitch black look gray instead but OLED displays don't need a backlight, allowing the dark areas of your image to stay dark. To sum up, next time somebody tries to sell you a phone with a 4K screen, you're probably not going to notice the difference. Unless you keep holding that phone right up close to your face, honestly, do you hear me? I'll see you on the next video. Oh, do, do, do.